All right, welcome everybody back to another exciting episode of Backyard Baseball. We're on the second game of Season 4, and we got A-Team. Not sure if it's a great team, but we've, we've certainly got A-Team. Pablo really, really carried us last game with his amazing home run that saved us. Pete did pretty well getting uh, getting to score. And uh, Kimmy had insane increases along with Marky. And Angela, with an insane pitching game, struck out so many people. Annie, Charlie Brown, Kenny, and Reese, and I know, I'm sure Kimmy, are, are going to need to prove themselves a little bit. Because technically, Kimmy really didn't do anything last game. But I'm confident we can do well. <laughs> we we could do well. I've, I I have both, I have both faith in us. And because our first, last game we kind of learned which positions to put people, or rather which positions not to put people, hopefully this will help us out a little bit this game. Anyways, I think today we're facing off against the Detroit Tigers. So without further ado, let's start. This is another home game. Cool. All right, Angela, you're going back on the mound. So Angela and Charlie Brown are just fine. Uh, Kenny is also fine. Ooh, Annie with a fielding increase. That's pretty cool. I mean, again, the fielding stat really doesn't mean squat in this game, so I don't actually know what a plus three in fielding is actually going to entail. Pablo's fine. Pete is fine. Reese is fine. Marky's back to normal. And Kimmy still has the insane bonuses. Good grief. Well, all right. Well, as, basically, as long as we can play home games, Kimmy's going to be actually pretty stacked. This is great. <laughs> All right, Pete is definitely going to keep leading, and followed by Reese. Reese in the first inning can be has has decent speed, and as long as Pete gets on first, we can get Reese on first as well. Pablo can be a cleanup hitter, and Angela afterwards in case things go a bit awry. I I kind of like this order. Maybe I'll put Kenny towards the end, and Kimmy can but kind of be a little bit earlier. Yeah, yeah, I think I think maybe that'll work out a little bit better, and I definitely think that Reese at second is going to be way better than Reese at third. This way he doesn't throw his arm out and get tired immediately. So we're up against the Tigers. Oh no, they have Jorge Garcia! Oh dear! <laughs> well, we lost. He's the best. We also got Lance Lambert, and he's got a couple increases, so he's good at batting. Watch out for him. Davey Marion is pretty good. Rose Flugel is decent. Uh, Umberto is not great. Debbie Nagasawa, gotta watch out for her. Juan Gonzalez, yeah, he's pretty good. He's a pro. Oh, Betty Houston! <laughs> Uh-oh, Betty's not doing so hot today. <gasps> Guys, Betty has bad batting and is super slow. Double play opportunities. And Umberto is right after. And he's also slow. Okay, Betty and Umberto together, we can get a double play off of them. That's great. And then Rose is before them. Uh, Rose is also slow. So if Rose just doesn't hit it out of the park, we could get some double plays today. This is excellent. I love it. And then Adam Van Doren, he's got some increases as well. Okay, you know, I'm glad that I have some increases and they have some increases. That kind of balances it out. All right, folks. Well, Detroit Tigers should be an easy win. I can say that because I'm from Michigan. Let's begin game two. Well, it's that time again. Baseball is in the air and we're ready for another experience. Exciting BBL season! Hiya, folks! Welcome to Backyard Baseball. I'm Sunny Day, along with my broadcast partner, Vinny the Gooch. Folks, we're gonna bring you the best in baseball today. Home runs, triple plays, strikeouts, live action from some of the hottest players in the league this season. The best in baseball. Boy, you're sure enthusiastic today. I had a good breakfast. <laughs> By good breakfast, you mean a corn dog? The Detroit Tigers and the crazy bombers. <laughs> he sounds so disappointed when he says our name. Time, because I'm tired of the same old stuff. I'm counting on you kids to keep me entertained here. I mean, don't even think about that hey, batter, batter baloney. It's been done. You know what I'm saying? You've heard him here first, folks. Vinny has said it, and therefore it is gospel. Baseball. Let's hear it for the best team in the BBL, the Bombers. I mean, the Tigers won their first game, too. I gotta admit, the Tigers logo is pretty epic. They, they do have that going for them. <laughs> All right, Detroit Tigers versus Crazy Bombers. Well, the Tiger is one of the most majestic of animals, but we've got explosives on our side, so I wonder who's going to win. Watch out for this one, kid, because I throw pretty fast, you know. No, you don't! The heat is your worst pitch by far. Alright, it's time for the Juan and only Gonzalez. 
Let's get him with the slow ball again. Hey, yeah! He never expects the slow ball. Alright, Angela just struck out a professional baseball player. This is off to a good start. I like it. She's a family connection, so it's not the same. Alright. Okay, no. Marky, go back to first. Marky! Marky, you go on first, you stay on first. Oh, no. That's not good. Debbie is cracked at batting. Not to the same extent as Xena, but, uh... Oh, never mind. Kenny? Oh, shoot. No, 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 Reese. Throw it here. Nice out, Annie. Good job. Okay. <laughs> Charlie Brown just knocked Reese out. Alright. Kenny does not have as good of an arm as I remember, so change of plans. I know Kimmy has a good arm. Do we want Kenny in the outfield? Let's put Annie in the outfield. Kenny can be on third. That's fine. Let's try this. Plus, plus Annie has a fielding increase, whatever, whatever that actually means. <laughs> nice job, Kimmy! Good work, Dane. All right, that was that was a good start. Now pitching Betty Houston. Hey, look, Betty! Oh boy. <laughs> it's okay. Betty can't do nothing. Also, their infield is slow, so we absolutely can bunt. You're gonna bunt, and you're gonna like it. <laughs> Definitely. Nice job, Pete! Mr. Consistent! Alright, Reese. Your speed is literally your only good point, so... It's not even that good of a point. <laughs> I should have Pete Steele first. Even if this is like a strike. Okay, he actually has a good arm. Not quite good enough to get Pete out, but I don't think we're going to be stealing with the boy today. Which is a shame. Because it's hilarious to steal with Marky. Come on, Reese. We got peanut butter cups on the line. If you get on first... <laughs> this is our new strategy, just tire Betty Houston out by hitting fouls constantly. That was dumb. I should not have swung at that. Oh well. That is a weird face. <laughs> and he deflates like a balloon. Alright, Pablo, let's raise that batting average. Woo! Dane, the power. The power this little kid has. It's it's immense. Okay, that's a pop-up. Dern it. Drop it. No, but I turned errors on. Why is it my team colors are black and red? My team colors are black and red, but Angela's wearing a white dress. You didn't get the memo on the uniform, lady. Darn! Come on, Angela. You can do better than that. You might as well run, Pete. You might as well run. Oh, they were stupid. And Angela still barely makes it to first base. Oh, is that why we wear white? Because we're the home team? I didn't know that. Okay, Annie, you've got... Well, no, you don't have a batting increase. We need you to hit home run. Okay, you got the power, but this time you just... You gotta actually hit the ball. Okay, Annie, stop making your bat face for the ball. Sincerely, Coach. What the heck? Annie's bat face through the ball three times. Ah, oh, she's such a good sport about it, though. She's like, ah, oh, well, it happens. I give you an A-plus for attitude, Annie. But I give you a D in performance at the bat. <laughs> <laughs> Little Davy Marion. <laughs> Annie's got a gun. Okay, Vinny. I trust you completely. Alright. He was right. 
from the wind up and, the and then hook it on over. Doop -de doop doop. Oh wow. <laughs> and he wears sandals because she doesn't want to go full Marky, but she also doesn't like tennis shoes. Okay. All right, little Davy Marion. We'll throw the off speed again. So ball, so ball, so be do be do ball. Okay, Kenny, this is all you. Kenny, don't drop anything. Yeah. That's what we. That's why Kenny's on the team. Uh oh. I gotta admit, I am a little scared of Jorge. Oh dear! Coach Artie, why didn't you have me back on the team? I would have been so good! Jorge, I would have picked you, but Twitch chat said no. You should have picked me instead of Marky! Marky doesn't do anything for your team! I would have been so much better! How dare you insult Marky, Jorge! You're getting struck out- Ha! Huh? See? Look at that! A beautiful hit! And I'm going to beat Marky to the base, because I'm fast. See? That's just proof you should have picked me instead. Marky, come on, you gotta run faster. Sorry, coach! <laughs> I can't even be mad. Jorge, this is, um, Cammy. Um, no, 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 no. Charlie Brown, throw it to fur. Don't let... Charlie Brown, that was your freaking throw? Are you kidding me? You got no arm. You're a six at fielding. You should have a better arm than that. Wow. I told you! You, sh you should have picked Jorge Garcia! Oh, no, you don't. Angela, for the love of God, you are not allowed to trip again on that ball. Wait, what? Wait, what? How the heck did we get a double play? How did we get a double play there? That'll bring our team up to bat. One left on. Uh, what? Did I miss something, or did the game just glitch and give us a double play from nothing? Okay, I'll take it. But man, if that happened to the enemy, if that happened to them, that would have been so stupid. All right then. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Come on, Marky. Hit it out of the park, boy! That's not out of the park! Well, duh. It's okay, Marky. He's super dumb. You knocked him unconscious! Come on, Marky! You got this, boy! Yeah! Hey, good job, man. Oh, man. You know what? Hand it up to Jorge, who's such a good sport and even congratulates us for doing well. What? What a Chad. Okay. Charlie Brown. I can't believe I'm about to bunt with the two slowest people on uh, my team, but I think this is the best opportunity we're gonna get. No! Good grief! How is that not a strike? That's bad. Did we just waste our only crazy bunt? Uh oh. No, we didn't. There we go. Good job, Charlie Brown. Oh my gosh, Marky's so slow. <laughs> Come on, Marky. Go into the outfield! Come on, go into the outfield! Do you stupid crazy bunt? Slide. <gasps> wow, okay, well that was the dumbest crazy bunt. It literally never even went to the outfield, but this is why I use the crazy bunt, because we got Kimmy, who can smash it out of the park, potentially. <gasps> Never mind, change of plans, we're using another crazy bunt. Because <laughs> she's all so fast! Ha-ha! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, everybody advance. <laughs> we only saw it last... Come on, move into the outfield! <laughs> there we go. Jorge, it's back there. That's a triple, maybe an in-park home run for Kimmy. Oh my gosh, that guy's so fast! That guy is so fast! Go home, Kimmy, inside the park home run. Oh my gosh, she's slowing down a bit, but that's okay! Oh my gosh, Kimmy Ekman, MVP! What reality am I playing this game in? <laughs> okay, good. If they had given me a third, that would have been just uncalled for. Actually, no. Let's go power with Kenny, because why not? Kimmy, I'm buying you Twinkies after the game. 
I have hit home runs with Kenny pretty consistently, but in the 97 version. I'm not sure if they nerfed him in this. Okay, well, that, I'm normally used to getting a bit more distance than that. Oh my gosh. Thank you. No, I'm not going to second. <laughs> nice job. Okay, their catcher has a cannon. Which is a bit of a shame. But that also means that their infield can't really catch their stuff properly. Alright. Pete, we're going power now. Nope, that was dumb. I swung too early there. Reese, if you can get on first and advance, Kenny, then Pablo might be able to get us another free runs. Alright, Reese. Let's hit a line drive. Swapping out for little Davy Marion. All right, Betty's got to be gassed at this point. <gasps> Please get on. No, he's gonna catch that. <gasps> oh my gosh! Guys, that's another power up for us. <laughs> Never you throw the slow mo. Slow mo's the easiest special pitch to catch or to hit. All right, screaming line drive. Probably the worst of the power-ups, but it's still good. Whoa! Yeah! <laughs> oh wait, no, shoot, that's a pop-up. Get ready to go back. <laughs> or he's like, we're doing pretty well. <laughs> All right, if we got two on and it's Angela, we're going screaming line drive. Booyah! Kenny's going home. And Reese going to third, I think. Alright, nice job advancing. I hope we have another screaming line drive, otherwise we're out here. Oh, screaming line drive for Annie would be so good. But we don't get it. Okay, well, I, well, I tried hitting power, and apparently her bat just phased through the ball, so we're trying line drive now. There we go. That's it. That's it. Well, it was fun playing baseball while it lasted. That's okay. Annie with the zero batting average. That's not good. But hey, four points, one inning. That's amazing. Oh, cool. Betty and Umberto are really slow. And Betty is gassed for being the pitcher. So... We'll walk Betty. So we can get that double play. As long as Umberto doesn't hit it super far, which he shouldn't. He's only like five or six at batting. <laughs> You're supposed to swing at these. There you go. Just give him the walk. All right, Umberto. I actually want him to get a hit on this. I should throw... Let's throw slow balls down the middle. Here, get a hit on this. Okay, that's actually a good... Oh, Charlie Brown... This is on you, Charlie Brown. This is on you, Charlie Brown. That was on you. We still almost got them out. Okay, wait. For, wait. Well um. done. <laughs> well, all right. Why the heck did you decide to go the second? <laughs> yeah, Charlie Brown's kind of the weak link on my team. <laughs> But I designed him. I, <laughs> I deliberately designed him to be that way, and you can't diminish that. Oh my gosh, Angela. Can you, Marky, go back on first base. Are you serious right now? That, is, that happened the, that's the exact same thing that happened the first time he was at bat. Angela's like, oh, I can't catch it. And then Marky's like, I'm going to run right off of first. And then literally everyone dropped the ball. It's true. I do. All right, Angela, throw it. Thank you. I don't think there has been a single time that the ball has been hit right to Angela that she hasn't dived and not caught it and been, like, completely knocked out. All right, it's time for yeehaw! <gasps> oh, yes! <laughs> Who should we use that on? <gasps> oh my gosh, we could hit a home run with Reese Worthington. We're not, we're not hitting it with Marky. There's nobody on base. 
Marky will get on base on his own merits. I've never hit a home run for Reese Worthington, with Reese Worthington, so we're saving it for Reese. Charlie Brown is also up at bat next. No, Charlie Brown, you can get a home run later. I can't believe we got an aluminum power bat in this game this early. Marky, that was Marky hitting the power. Oh, but they they flubbed it. They flubbed it. Go, Marky! Yeah! How does Marky get on first base this frequently? No, no logical explanation exists for that. He just always does. They played deep, deep for Marky. Marky hit a power. It went two inches, and he somehow got on first. Okay. No, that's bad, actually. Oh wait, but maybe they run into each other. Well, duh. Marky. Well, <laughs> How? How is this happening? <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, Kimmy Ackman, and she's got massive increases. Kimmy. <laughs> They're like, Davey, you are off. <laughs> Marky is king of the heart attacks this season. This is like the sixth Marky heart attack that we've had. I'm not aluminum power batting with Kimmy. I think she's capped at batting. She can hit it with regular power. That's too low. It's way too low. Kimmy, when she's playing on her home field, has massive increases, so I think she can get a home run regularly. Or that could happen. It's a foul. We are playing with fire, because all of the guys here, except for Kimmy, are slow. Kimmy. Kimmy. Kimmy, you gotta make contact and aim for the fence. Do it. Or we could... Oh, you jerkwads! How could you do that? They used the big freeze on Kimmy. She's that frightening. Aluminum power bat with Kenny would also be amazing, but I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm saving that for Reese. I'm I'm, I'm anticipating I'm only getting one. Although, man, if I could hit a home run with Kenny eventually, that would be amazing, because Kenny's theme song is amazing. You spit on that ball. That's illegal, Umberto. How? Wow! He didn't last long. They're just cycling for all their players. Marky's in the background just giving me the head, like, pups up, like, Yeah, coach, you got this! Oh. It's okay, Kenny. Alright, Pete, you could get the home run here. But if you can advance everybody, that would honestly be best case scenario. If Pete can advance everybody, that would be best case scenario, because then it would be Reese Grand Slam. Or if they walk Pete. I would love it so much if they walked Pete. Is that a ball? <gasps> Oof! Reese Worthington Grand Slam! Reese Worthington Grand Slam. Dude, how is Backyard Baseball getting this epic this early? If Reese foul- if Reese messes this up... I mean, I know it would be me messing it up, but if Reese messes this up, either by fouling it or, like, it doesn't go far enough. Alright. I am speed. Don't walk, Reese. Don't walk, Reese. Then Pablo's up next. There we go! <laughs> I have never heard Reese's theme play on the home run before. <laughs> Neither do I! <laughs> 585?! That's insane! Guys, I think we got the game in the bag. You know 
most exciting thing about winning? It's when you win. I love that feeling. Power hit like a weapon. <laughs> Except for Reese Worthington with a. Please give me another one. <gasps> we have another one. Okay. We're saving that for Charlie Brown or for, uh. Uh, Kenny. I'm sure people are like, Marky! Marky! But I would. I'd rather save it for Kenny or one of the others. Kenny and the Jets. Pablo, you're a little off your game today, but that's okay because you saved the game last. There's nobody. There's nobody there. <laughs> All right, is that a triple? <laughs> no, it's just a double. Okay, that's fine. Charlie Brown for end of the season. That's counting on us getting an aluminum power bat at the end. Angela's been a little disappointing as far as batting goes, even though she's gotten two singles today. Darn it. It's okay, guys. We get to start strong because we start with Marky again next inning. We went for our whole batting lineup that inning. Debbie, Lance, and Davey. The Bombers are out in front, up by eight. The Bombers are annihilating their competition. Debbie Absolutely, we are. I forgot how good Reese's theme is. I never hear it. <laughs> okay, Debbie. That was a nice hit. Oh, Charlie Brown, you got this, right? Or Reese. Nope, neither of you have it. Okay, Marky, stop moving off the base. Are you... Good grief. It's Dumb and Dumber on second and shortstop. <laughs> Charlie Brown, you're a six at fielding. How are you this bad at fielding? Oh, that's right, because the fielding stat means nothing. Reese, you're an 8 at fielding. You have no excuse for being this bad. Kenny's a 4 at fielding, and he's flawless. Watch out for this one, kid, because I throw pretty fast, you know. No, you don't. <laughs> I'm 28 pitches in a row, kid. Now give us another one, baby. What can I do but obey? Boop, 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 boop. He took the lamb of the poor man. You hit it into Rabbit's Garden. First, his carrot extractor wasn't working, and now you're gonna hit a baseball into his into his backyard. Just for people who don't know, that's a call forward to something you might see on my channel in the future. All right, let's get him out of here. Let's let's use the left hook and throw him off. Kenny, you got this right, bro. Angela, don't run into him. Dude, catch it. Yo, Marky, don't step off the base. If you just let it bounce, we would have got her out in a double play. Mar I liked Marky because he never left first base. Now he's leaving it constantly. Is it because the field is bigger? Oh, no. Guys, I'm scared. Jorge's back, and Jorge means business. Jorge's doing great. That's right, watch me hit a home run here. Catch this. I'll be back next! I'll be back next, you need new peons! <laughs> Oh man, the Jorge Garcia voice is my favorite. Oh wait, shoot, it's not a Marky Duboy start to the inning. It's Annie. <laughs> I I look forward to the day we get to bring Jorge back on the team. Also, how come the game class of What? Stand by. <clears throat> Unless I'm mistaken, that kid just walked over a wall, onto a jungle gym, defied gravity, and caught the ball. Okay. That was weird. But also, the, another reason why I left is because I had an idea. As it turns out, I have this massive jar of candy stars that I won at uh, at my nephew's first birthday party, and I still have a bunch of them, and this is the perfect opportunity. Every run I score, 
I eat a candy star. They're very, very tiny. So we'll start by eating four, and we can eat more as the game goes on. So this is what I'll do with them. Okay, well, we're moving on from that. It's time for the boy. Oh, are you having cake? Bring the lined up huh? and the delivery. That was at the edge of the strike zone. Yeehaw! Oh, okay. So you can just walk over that part of the wall? Or is the entire field levitated on top of that fence? Is it like a pool? <laughs> it's an elevated pool. You trying to bean my best player? Marky's two for two today, and he's going to be free for free. Because he can hit the power! Or he can be walked. That was ball two. Two and two. This is a common trend among already plays back or baseball. I eat stuff during it. I know, that's the second time they've almost beaned you. From the lined up and the delivery. Yeehaw! <laughs> Everyone went to the opposite and don't catch it. No! Okay, you know, I gotta hand it to that guy. That was a cool catch. I just drink water during all visual novels. Okay, Charlie Brown. Bring the power. Or get walked in. Kimmy Ekman can bring the power. At this point, half of their team has been pitcher. Dang, Charlie Brown! That was a powerful hit. I mean, that's a pop-up, so they're going to catch it, but... And he's out. Darn it. This inning is over. The Bombers ahead, up by eight. The Bombers are annihilating their competition. Here comes Jorge Garcia. I'm back by popular demand. It's me. It is I, Jorge Garcia. All right, Jorge, let's see what you got. I am so powerful, I can bend the bat when I swing it. Hit this slow ball. Do it. Easily. And I'm going to knock Angela unconscious again. No, you're not. Don't go <laughs> Of all the characters' voices, Jorge is by far my favorite to do. Er, Jorge and Marky. Uh-oh. Pablo. Okay, cool. You stopped the ball. That's fine. Oh, dang. And Rose is slow. No, no, no. That's fine. Rose is slow. She's a big liability. And it's Betty! Hey, look! Betty! Yes. Okay. No, this is perfect. Betty sucks at batting, and she's super slow. We're going to pitch slow balls down the middle. She'll get a hit, and we can get a double play, potentially. Yes. Okay. No. No, no. Catch this. Don't leave the base. Don't leave the base. Okay, thank goodness, Marky. You gotta stop leaving the base, man. But at least we got another double play. Okay, we gotta use our power ups this inning, folks. So we're using aluminum power bat on Kenny. Oh my gosh, we have a crazy bunt. That's amazing. We have gotten so many power ups this game. It's nuts. Whoa! Ground ball up the first baseline. Wait, that wasn't a foul? That wasn't a foul? Okay, and wow, we just barely got on base. But this is great! Kenny Kawaguchi, two-run homer. Okay, pitcher, give me one right over the Kenny's, Kenny's overall theme is, I think, the most underrated. I'll make you guys a deal. If they walk Kenny, I will do another Reese Worthington in Grand Slam. Here's the pitch. I'm not swinging at that. I know it's technically a strike, but I don't have confidence that Kenny would be able to hit it. There we go! Kenny Kawaguchi, ladies and gentlemen! Two more stars. <laughs> you did so good, Kenny. So proud of you. Ten runs. We 
could still make this the 20 run game. I still want to get a 20 run game. I'm gonna hit a touchdown. No freaking way. No freaking way we got a, a third one. Oh man, if we can save that for Charlie Brown, I will. Because we also have a crazy bunt on top of that. Uh oh. No, that's bad. That's real bad. No! That hardly ever happens. I'm actually going to just crazy bunt with Reese right now. Now that's what I call a crazy bunt. Ooh, he's so tired, though. Nice job, Reese. Nice double. I really hope we have another crazy bunt after that, because that would be great. Pablo's only one for free day. Does Reese Worthington have a higher batting average than Pablo? Oh my gosh, we have another, we have another crazy bunt. Saving that for Angela. Pablo might be able to get a home run, though. Really? That was a strike? Alright. No chance at a double play unless I'm stupid, though, so... Ooh. Yeah, there we go! That's deep. Oh, shoot, are you kidding me? Dane, oh no, no, she's got a cannon. Wow! Darn it, Pablo's gotten two almost home runs. Unless we get cheesed with the crazy bunt. We can crazy bunt with Angela and then aluminum power bat with Annie. Alternatively, if we have another crazy bunt after this, we crazy bunt with her, Marky Duboy Grand Slam. Although I'd like to get a home run with Annie. She's got such a peaceful theme song. Mm, I know that's a strike. Oh no, it's not a strike. Very glad I didn't crazy bunt there. The crazy bunt graphic looks like one of those like Brunwick bowling shorts. Went at the bowling alley when it's like, you got three strikes in a row. Now this bowling ball that looks like a turkey is gobbling at you. It's true. It's true. Pablo's allowed some bad games. Oh my gosh. Okay, I kind of would have liked the crazy bunt to go a little farther than that, but... I don't think it'll be a Charlie Brown Grand Slam, because he's still a couple of people away. So if we still have another crazy bunt, we will do that with Annie, otherwise aluminum power bat with Annie. Okay, aluminum power bat with Annie. Don't phase your bat through the ball again this time, all right, Annie? I mean, if you want to walk Annie so we can get a Marky Dubois Grand Slam, that's also a lot of fun. I don't think... Th no, that, I don't think that was a strike, because you can see no part of that is inside the zone. There we go! Packs of power! This is way too peaceful of a song for, like, a massive home run. <laughs> nice job, Annie. If we have another one... If we have another aluminum power bat... Then Marky's gonna yeehaw. Oh, okay. Rats. <laughs> Annie had to outshine Reese by a little bit. Yeehaw! Okay, Marky, it's okay. Statistics show you're still gonna get on first somehow. Run, Marky. Oh my gosh, Marky the boy should not be getting this lucky. <laughs> Charlie Brown. Charlie Brown, everyone else has pulled their weight this game. It's time for you two as well. Okay, I'm sorry. At this point, has literally everyone on their team except for Jorge and the pro been pitcher? Because it sure feels like it. This is what happens when I pick Marky. He does way better than he should. Oh my gosh. Whoa! No freaking way! Charlie Brown just hit a home run! <laughs> 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 
Charlie Brown just showed us up. I was ragging on him, like, you need to start pulling your weight, and he just cracks it. He didn't even need an aluminum power bat. Good lord! <laughs> At this point, everyone has hit a home run, except for Pete and Angela. Oh, and Marky, I guess. So help me if Kimmy Ackman actually gets a home run here. This is game two. How is it this epic? Did Kimmy just hit a home run as well? No, she didn't. It's right to Rose. That's okay. That's fine, Kimmy. You did so good. Seven points this inning. Fifteen points! That's nuts! <laughs> she got a home run. It was just inside the park. wouldn't want to meet this kid in a dark alley. I wouldn't want to meet him in a light alley, either. Alleys are scary. Dang, Detroit, Detroit Tigers are getting wrecked. I told you, this would be an easy game. The Tigers are just not a good team. Oh, I'm absolutely going to edit in Peanuts music. Probably Linus and Lucy. As that's the most quintessential Peanuts song. <laughs> we know it's true, but I mean, I feel bad saying it. Because, I mean, I am from Michigan. No point in getting a double play now, because, well, <laughs> no, we don't get up at bat again. Alright, how many hit, how many balls is Juan, is Gonzalez going to hit? Juan. Told ya. Okay, nope. Dug on Marky! Actually, that was not Marky at all, that was Angela not having the arm of a girl. Adam Van Doren. Which, I mean, she is a girl, so I guess that makes sense. Well, we may as, we may as well guzzle some juice. We have it. Gulp, gulp. Drink some water. Trust me, you don't want to steal when Kimmy Ekman is the catcher. Because Kimmy... Kimmy might have the best arm out of my team. Puns are great, and I will defend this. You know what? Why not? Okay, I kind of wanted Kimmy to go for that, but that's okay, Angela. Nope. Why are you both going to second? What the heck? Kenny, you stepped off the base like a loon. Especially since you're in a wheelchair. That's what I seen when I drink the juice box. <laughs> they have a power up. We're 15 points up. I want to give the Detroit Tigers at least one chance to get a comeback. All right, Debbie, you're out. Angela has a hundred aggression. Does she actually? I thought only Lisa Crockett had 100 aggression. We're not going to get 20-0. It's physically impossible at this point, because once, they, once they've once they finished, then that's it. The game's over. Because even if we were to go extra time, it's just like, well, we've already won, so... So it's not a shutout game. They did score a point. Oh no, they know it's Charlie Brown. They know he can't throw. Good great. Okay, they get two runs. Good job. Baby Marion. This young batter means business. Runner on first, two out. I don't really care if it, I didn't really care to get a 0-15 victory anyways. I just want to I'm playing this to have some fun. You know, Marty, I think you're right. I think we do need a Marky Duboy emote. <laughs> 100%. Pete Wheeler. Throw it back in. So how many screaming line drives do you think they'll get? Um, no, throw it to Ferd. Throw it to Ferd! You loon! Get him out. And the Bombers win the game! 15-2. What an outstanding game this has been. A victory these kids won't soon forget.
They played hard and got what they deserve. Live from Ekman Acres, this has been Sunny Day and Vinny the Gooch. See you next time. Dude, that game was freaking epic. It's going to be hard to top that game, and this is the second game. <laughs> I can't even imagine what the, the World Series is going to be like, assuming we get to the World Series, which, I mean, come on. We, we probably can. Oh, man, I hope the Tigers make it far. I'd love to play them multiple times. All right, again, I don't know the team icons, so here we are. If we go to the standings, we've won two. Nobody. Okay, cool. Nobody else here has won two games. Rangers have won twice, Braves have won twice, the Reds have won twice, and the Diamondbacks and the Blue Jays have won twice. Cool! So there's there are no uh, there are no leagues where the t two teams have won twice, so that's pretty cool. Hardy blew them out of the water. We they bombed. <laughs> Alright, most home runs is Mikey Thomas, Jacinda Smith, and Sophie Meyer. Okay. Most hit How is Sidney Weber having the most hits? It's ridiculous. Charlie Brown has some of the most doubles. He got two. That's amazing. Runs batted in. Reese Worthington, number four for runs batted in, just because of that. Kimmy Ekman is also on the list. I don't know how to feel this about this. Uh, Marky Dubois has some of the highest amount of runs scored. Does that mean he's touched home a bunch, or does that mean that his batting has caused people to go home a bunch? I think it runs scored is he's reached the home plate a bunch, which is funny because he's like easily one of the slowest characters in the game. It's amazing. Sidney Weber has the highest batting average of onside Minotti. Slugging percentage, Xena. Yeah, no shocker there. Pete and Jorge and Marky. Top three for steals. I'm so happy about this. <laughs> three of my favorite characters. That's just fantastic. AD. Oh, she doesn't have the most strikeouts anymore. Freaking Tina beater. All right, we got it. We got it. The Florida Marlins, Tina, you're going down. Amir Khan with the highest earned run average. And Angela and Reese with the most errors. I'm kind of surprised Charlie Brown's not on the list, given how many times he literally dropped the ball. But all right, <laughs> that's still funny. <laughs> yeah, I think we do need a Marky Boy emote. He's he's magic. He, he should not have gotten to first base like at all this game, and he got to first base, I think, every single time. So that's just nuts. Marky's now the face of Artie playing backyard baseball. It's kind of true. How it goes, folks, every single season, I put a character on the team kind of as a joke, and then they end up being, like, a huge part of my team. So in the first season, it was Tony, who was just, like, a random pick at the end, and he became, like, the f most famous character out of the first three. Season two, I picked Marky, and he ended up being amazing. And then season three, I picked the custom character, who ended up being amazing. So out of this bunch, if I had to guess, it'll probably end up being Kimmy Ekman, <laughs> who I will predict will become, like, the mainstay, or, like, Angela. Or Reese. I could honestly see Reese, but oh, I don't like Reese at all. <laughs> No, no, Marty. Master Tony joined the dark side. I really hope, I really hope we face off against Tony in the World Series. That would be amazing. And worst case scenario, folks, it is possible to hack the game. So if I wanted to, I could learn from the Backyard Baseball Discord and I could end up hacking the game and make a team of my choice for the World Series. <laughs> I know exactly what team I would make. <laughs> and it would be amazing. <laughs> But no promises there. That might be cheating a little too much. Although, for those of you who are wondering, oh, Artie, you're going to cheat and make the team really easy. No, no, no. No, I would do the opposite. <laughs> I would make the team hard, but really fun. <laughs> We're up against nine Jorge's. The, the problem with having all of one character or multiple copies of one character is they all... Like, let's say you have like nine Jorge's. Yeah, you have, you have nine Jorge's, but all nine of those Jorge's share one stamina bar. Which means they all get completely gassed and will never recover it. And they're ridiculously so slow and can't play. So it would actually be insane. All Xenas. Oof. No thank you. <laughs> no thank you. <laughs> you know, I think I think we just gotta end the backyard baseball part of this here. So n next time, on Monday, we will play the Indians. And it's another home game. So Kimmy gets those stat boosts for one more game. But then we have free away games. And she's gonna go to pot. All right. Yeah, we'll continue this on Monday, 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So thank you for watching, everyone. This was an amazing game.